Tonight is the fourth and final night of the Democratic National Convention. It is set to begin at 6.30 in Chicago. And we have a live look for you at the United Center. And several big names are expected to speak tonight, including Vice President Kamala Harris herself, who will formally accept the Democratic nomination for the President of the United States. And that is also where we find NBC's Bree Jackson, who's covering the convention for us. So, Bree, can you set the scene for us tonight? What can we expect? Hi there, Betsy, Matt. Well, you can expect Kamala Harris to deliver what is arguably the biggest speech of her life, and her remarks will come at the closing of a convention aimed at convincing voters that she can lead the country. What we're seeing right now uh, is somewhat of an ode to Kamala Harris. We're seeing a lot of people here in the crowd tonight wearing white in honor of women's suffrage, as well as pink and green in recognition for the historically black sorority that Kamala Harris is a member of. Tonight, we do expect Kamala Harris to share her personal and professional story as she lays out her vision for the country in contrast to that of former President Donald Trump. Another thing that people will be looking for is if Kamala Harris differentiates her policies from President Biden. Now, one thing uh, we do notice here, or ha we have noticed all week is that while there's a sense of excitement and enthusiasm inside the convention uh, for Kamala Harris, we've seen plenty of protests. We've seen thousands of protesters throughout this week, in particular uh, pro-Palestinian Palestinian protesters who are calling for a ceasefire in Gaza. They want Kamala Harris to take a stance, and they want her to call for a ceasefire, and they also want her uh, to. Uh, uh, in this, the transfer of weapons uh, to Israel. Now, tonight, Kamala Harris is expected to outline her policies and her stance, as well as uh, try to send her message to the American public of why they should uh, make history by sending the first woman to the White House. All right, Bree Jackson, live for us tonight from uh, Democratic National Convention. Thank you so much.